mosquitoes are like a major thing here because um, of the malaria. 19-year-old Jamelia Kadir I got the female one. Is getting some hands-on experience at the Center for Infectious Disease Research. Started in March and it's been it's been a learning experience and I just I love it. The recent high school graduate is one of more than 2,000 young people in Seattle participating in the Mayor's Youth Employment Initiative. She says this internship is opening doors for her and inspiring her to consider a career in the medical field. I want to become a nurse at first, but coming here, I've like got more options of, um, there's more to nursing than just being an actual nurse. I want to be a clinical research nurse. So that opens up a lot of doors for me just by being here. Can you take a look at this? Yeah, let me have a look. Okay. Oh, this is the first year for the Center for Infectious Disease Research, located off Westlake Avenue, to participate in the program. They say they see it as a win-win. They provide a great opportunity for a young person, and they get to tap into fresh talent, no matter what time of year. We'd like this program to be a year-round opportunity of real substance, so that when people are completing the program, they are able to have a set of skills um, again, to propel their, their own careers, but it also helps the center with some consistency in the lab. This is my first job. In Columbia City, 17-year-old Lonnie Stubblefield is learning about the restaurant industry at Tutabella. Hi. This one. But she's also learning some important life skills while boosting her confidence. I learn a lot about working with people because I'm kind of shy. So it's like fun to get to talk to people because my position is meet and greet, so like when people come in, I have to be like vocal with them and like ask them how they're doing so that they're, they feel welcome in here. Lonnie's manager says she is very impressed with how well she's doing and could see them expanding with the program in the future to provide more opportunities for young people. I could see us uh, participating with our other two locations in Seattle um, and then potentially if we open more in Seattle um, or even just having more interns in you know, our Columbia City location. I think it'd be yeah, great to bring more people on. The Mayor's Youth Employment Initiative is a program that's been in place for many years. But what's different this year is a huge expansion and commitment to grow the program. That way more Seattle youth can have this important experience which could have a dramatic effect on the community. Unemployment for young people in Seattle who are, who are uh, of color is about 28%. The city's unemployment rate is about just 5%. That's a dramatic difference, and that is not a good thing if we want to create uh, folks who uh, have job skills and are going to succeed in school. That is a very negative thing, to have so many young people of color, 28%, who don't have access to a job. Sarah will be right with you. This program hopes to dramatically change those unemployment rates You're welcome. and is getting some much needed help from partners in the private sector. Companies like Starbucks, Bank of America, Amazon, and Boeing all participate. And J.P. Morgan Chase recently awarded the program a half a million dollars. Mayor Murray says the program is not just changing young people's lives, you. it's also encouraging a lot of the employers themselves. The young people love it, but what's interesting is how some of the employers are really energized after they get these young high school students, mostly high school, not just high school, but mostly high school students who are, they find them to be, you know, bright and energized and they bring a different perspective. So I'm hearing great things from employers. And it's that type of partnership and support that will help to keep this program going strong for many years to come. Let's put it like right there, right there cool. So more youth like Bashan McCants will have the opportunity to gain valuable work experience that one day might lead to a permanent dream job. Hopefully I can get on full time. I could be doing this for the rest of my life. I like working outdoors, you know. I don't like sitting in a cubicle, no air. I like working out here. Hard, I like the hard work. I'm a big guy. I like the work.
They just need the opportunity, right? And programs like this allow people to, to get the opportunity to show that they're ready to work hard. They want to be a part of it. They want to make it happen. Uh, and they just need a chance. Just clear a little bit of that ivy right over there. Doing better, better things, open more doors. It's cool, it's a good experience. Watch CityStream Thursday nights at 7 on the Seattle Channel. Or get video on demand and podcasts anytime at seattlechannel.org.